Um, all right. Um, Thanksgiving week uh, is probably, uh, me personally, my, my favorite week of the year. Uh, if you're playing football this time of the year, then you're pretty fortunate. Um, you know, I've told the kids here the last couple of days that uh, <laughs> take advantage of it while you can because when it's gone, you're going to miss this. Uh, being able to spend time with your, with your football family for an entire week uh, with no distractions, just worried about football, just worried about preparing to play a, a Big 12 football game is something that they, they will miss when it's gone. So take advantage of it and make the most of it. Okay. Um, and moving on to the next opponent, uh, you know, just got done having a small little practice out there with the guys, switched the schedule up a little bit based on it being uh, Thanksgiving week. So uh, happy Thanksgiving to everybody. But uh, th this is the best week of the year for a college football team. Um, you know, just uh, being able to eliminate distractions is, is, is good. Uh, not having school. Uh, uh, makes it easier from the scheduling point of view. So uh, being able to get these guys up here every morning uh, to feed them a little bit more than we normally can and, and meet and lift and practice and get them out of here at a decent time sets up good seeing how this game is uh, noon kick. Uh, should be used to noon kicks at this point, but it, I think it works out good from a scheduling point of view this, this, this week for all that. Growing up, being able to watch these games <clears throat> on Thanksgiving, on Thursday and Friday and Saturday, it's 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 a great time of the year. So, a great week of practice. We better uh, prepare like we have all year. Uh, you know, this is a great week for football. If you're playing football during Thanksgiving, then you're fortunate. And we we got very minimal distractions this week that we'll be able to uh, focus hard on on our opponent and uh, get ourselves ready to play. Uh, it, it's going to be a challenge. This is. Uh, this is personally my favorite week of the year. Uh, not necessarily who we're playing, but um, as far as just the, what the weekly routine is, uh, it's a it's a football week, you know. And there's a lot of there's less distractions, and you know it has everything to do with uh, with with just football and your football family and getting to spend a little bit more time with each other. So. Uh, you know, yesterday we still gave them a day off, even though there's no school. Um, still got to have a day off. And today and tomorrow, you know, a lot of football time, a lot of football uh, stuff. Get to go out and practice. We got awesome weather to be able to go out and do that. And we all know we need a lot of that at this point. So, and then Thursday, obviously, <clears throat> you know, get them up here and, and practice a little bit. And then, uh, you know, get to spend the rest of the day uh, just kind of hanging out, you know, whether it's uh, hanging out with the guys or coaches or family or whatever it is. So uh, Friday, get to travel, and Saturday, get to play a great football team. Well, this is the best week of the year um, for a lot of reasons. Uh, this is my favorite holiday, like every coach is going to say in his press conference. It's the f best week of the year. Uh, Thanksgiving, food, family football, doesn't get any better than this. So, um you know, has always been a fun week. Um, and then you add the element of, of this game, and it, it's going to be it's going to be an awesome week. So uh, we've already started it out on a, on a good note, and um, you know, are are already fully prepared to play this game. So in, in a good spot. Uh, you know, got all my buddies there in Oklahoma coming up to to visit uh, for the game on Friday. Uh, Probably have Lincoln and his wife Caitlin and Bedenboe and Ruffin and Dennis and all those guys that I'm very familiar with that I was with at Texas Tech for years and years and years. Probably have them over for Thanksgiving dinner on Thursday night and we'll hang out and uh, you know watch some NFL games together and talk about the good old days. Probably right. So. Um, you know, it'd be it'd be a fun week. It should be a fun week for everybody. I know they're excited about it as well. TCU, this is uh, it's kind of one of my favorite weeks of the year. Um, you know, our guys. You know, we have a lot of guys who want to be NFL players. This is a, this is an opportunity. They get a they get a peek of what the NFL lifestyle is. They're out of school. Uh, there's nobody else really around. So they basically it's a it's a football week. It's a it's a great opportunity for us to kind of spend this last week together as a 2019 team. Uh, we'll do a lot of team activities and things like that. Um, 
and we're going to we're going to be in, uh, intentional about enjoying this. I think we need to finish this on a positive note. Um, send our seniors out here on on a feeling good about what they've done. And again, you know, outside of maybe one or two, I think that they played their best football uh, in their senior year. And I appreciate that group. I talked about them after after the game on Saturday.